making Google a ha a ha making Google Google. <laughs> Oh. Hi, I'm Matt and this is Not Enough Tech. Bear in mind, I'm going to talk to my Amazon Echo and Google Home device might contribute so <laughs> obviously. <laughs> So mute your devices. So with that said, let's talk about Amazon Echo notifications because that's something that I actually discovered it's possible now. It's only been around for a couple of months and I'm so excited to use it. Previously, I had a video uh, in the corner there explaining how Google notifications work and how you can issue a node red message to Google Home so the uh, speaker would announce something that you want to know. I've used that successfully for my washing machine so in this corner you also can see washing machine notifying me when it's done and now I'll be able to link this to Amazon Echo. So let's take a look how the notify me works in action making Amazon Echo Talk, it's very simple. All I have to do is just to press the button to send a notification to Amazon Echo device. Alexa, I'll read my notification. One new notification from Notify Me. How cool are the new notifications? How cool was that? I don't believe it could be any more simple than that. It's just copy and paste the code, set up the note, and there you go, you have your custom notifications. To get started, open your Alexa app and go to your skills. In skills, look for Notify Me. This skill will enable that uh, notifications uh, that you can actually trigger it not only from a uh, node red, but also as a web request. But first, you need to get the special key that's going to be sent to you via email. So activate the skill and log in. And after that, uh, as the instructions say, open uh, your app via Amazon Echo. So simply just say, uh, Alexa, open Notify Me. And Alexa will issue an email with a special code that you can use for the Alexa Notify Me node. In Node Red, just go to Palette Manager and install uh, Alexa notify me uh, node. Once you've got that, just open that in and you should have an email by now with access code. It's going to be very long access code and then you can enter it here and the notification itself, it can be set by message payload. Now the node will accept only strings. So no order, uh, timestamps, numbers, etc. is allowed. So you'll have to convert everything into this string so as you can see, I'm just injecting a screen saying uh, how cool are the new notifications. And that's pretty much it. And so once this is issued, the Alexa will um, announce within a couple of seconds that there is a new notification, which you can uh, use uh, voice commands to open. Now, this comes with extra advantages because unlike Google Home, uh, you don't have to be around to receive that notification when you walk into the room and you'll see the notification that you can still read it and see what's up. Uh, while with Google Home, that wasn't the case that Google just, you know, spit out whatever uh, Google needed to say and you would have no indication of anything like this happen. So I'll be definitely playing with this and uh, I'll add those notifications for Alexa to my washing machine and a couple of more projects, that's for sure. The five messages per five minute limit, it might not be enough for you, it should be just fine with me. I don't imagine my Amazon Echo device going off every minute with a notification. I think that would drive me crazy. So for now, I'm gonna enjoy this. Uh, follow me on social media to see follow up videos, how I utilize that notify me with my current systems and the tutorials and projects I've made before. As for now guys, thanks so much for watching and like I said, no schedule in here so if you want to get notified just use the social media to keep in touch with me and you're definitely gonna get a notification when the new write-up is ready. Thanks so much for watching and see you in the next video. Take care, bye. All I have to do is just to press the button. What do you mean no access code?
Making Alexa talk is now very easy. I have. Oh no, 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 no. Cancel. <laughs>